hello everyone welcome back to my new video today i am going to show you how to crochet a panda it's very easy for beginners so let's get started i'm using 4 mm needle for this thread uh, black and white now for the round one let's start with the magic ring like this it's very easy and uh, inside the magic ring make six single crochet it's one two Once you finish all six single crochet, close the magic ring tightly, and uh, we'll go for a round two now. So for the round two, make six increase stitches, which is in one loop two stitches. This is first and second. So this is our one increase. Let's go for a second. in this chain we'll make two more single crochet one and two second increase like this we'll have to continue for next four stitches so total will be six increases so for every uh, round you can put a stitch marker to identify from where you have started the stitches so now round 3 one single crochet here and into the next chain one increase so one and into the same one more single crochet So for the round three, we'll have to follow this one single crochet and one increase six times. So total we'll get twelve stitches. Now round four, two single crochet, one into the next, second, and one increase, one, and into the same, one more. So this two single crochet and one increase. will repeat 6 times to get 24 stitches now round 5 3 single crochet one increase to get total 30 stitches so we'll repeat this for 6 times again 
to this three single crochet and now we'll make one rip increase so one and second in the same two so these are our three single crochet and one increase so we'll repeat one more time one two and three so these are our three single crochet and into the next one increase continue this for more four times So for now round 6 to 11 we will make 30 single crochet because right now we have all 30 stitches so let's continue until you reach to 11th round. We are done with 11 rounds so all 11 rounds looks like this let's proceed for round 12 one single crochet one decrease and one more decrease this we will repeat six times to get 18 stitches Now round 13, oh, add a black thread and make 18 back loop slip stitches. So 1, 2 to the next, 2, 3, these all should be in back loops. Okay, so once you are done with the round, add eyes, nose and stuff in.
yeah so it's done now let's go for a round 14 so into the front loop we are making two single crochet and one increase so this is our first single crochet it's little bit hard one and into the next one more single crochet two and now into the next stitch one increase so here one increase so this is one and one more continue the same into the front loops two single crochet and one increase so we'll have to repeat this six times to get 12 stitches so if you can see this closely you know i'm making single crochet and into the next one increase so one and two so let's uh, repeat this for the round and now our uh, these two rounds are ready So let's work for round 15 and 16, 24 single crochet because we have already made 24 stitches. So we'll continue for these two rounds. you are done once you are done with the 15 and 16 round add a white thread and work for round 17 and 18 so again 24 single crochet will continue for two rounds So now for row 19 into the back loop two single crochet it's one and into the next one more single crochet and one decrease so let's make into this next stitch one decrease yeah so we'll have to repeat this six times to get total 18 stitches so now again we'll have to add more stuffing into this rounds and now we'll go for a round 20 so one single crochet and one decrease so that's one single crochet into the next it's decrease decrease should be into the back loops so that is our one decrease 
so we'll repeat this again for six times to get 12 stitches one single crochet one decrease for six times So once you are done with the rounds, cut off the thread and take the tapestry needle. So now with the tapestry needle, we'll insert the needle into front loop of the stitches. So like into the front loop, one, two, like this, we'll have to insert in each front loop. and then pull the yarn so this is how you can tighten your thread and fix this Yes, our body is ready. Now, for the ears, make a magic ring and six single crochet into the magic ring. And for the round 2, we will make 6 increases. I will show this fast forward because at the starting only we have made this round 2, 6 single crochet and 6 increases. So now for the round 3 to 5, we will make 12 single crochet because we already have 12 stitches. So we will continue on that this 3, 4 and 5 rounds. So into this stitch, 1 single crochet, 1 more and we will continue for total 12 single crochets. And, and for the round 6, join both the sides to close and make 6 single crochet. So these are two sides and we'll insert into both the sides. Yeah, and that's our first single crochet. One, same into the next, but both the sides will have to insert. And two and three. So we'll continue for three more times. Yes, our two yours are ready. Now 
now let's uh, go for the hands again make one magic ring and six single crochet into the magic ring And now for round 2 to 4, make 6 single crochet. 1. Now into the next. 2. So we'll make 6 single crochet for 2, 3 and 4 rounds. And for the round 5, again join both the sides with the 3 single crochet. So that's 1, 2 and 3. Okay, now let's go for legs again for the round one we'll start with the magic ring and four single crochet into the magic ring till now we were doing six single crochet but now we'll make only four single crochet into the magic ring. two three and four Let's tighten it. Yeah. And now for the round 2, chain 1 and turn your work. And one single crochet, one increase, again one increase and one single crochet. Like this, we'll have to make for 4 stitches. Okay, so all our pairs are ready of ears, hands, legs. So let's attach all these parts with the tapestry needle. So first I'll fix these legs with the stitch marker so it should not move.
our little panda is ready oh thank you for watching like and subscribe